Okay, well today we're fishing and we're targeting pike. Uh, the bait shop was out of minnows, so that's going to make things very difficult. These are my old stomping grounds. I used to know exactly where every snag is in this uh, river here. Uh, nowadays, I have no idea. I haven't really fished this place good in, in two years, so uh, probably going to lose a lot of lures, unfortunately, but hopefully we'll be able to catch a pike. It's definitely going to be more of a challenge without minnows, but we're going to give it a shot. Should be uh, the pike are on the move this time of year. They're heading upstream to their summer in holes, so hopefully we can catch one or two. Got a hit. <laughs> oh man. Alright, well, something's hanging out down there. I don't know if it was, could have been a bass too. Or a walleye for that matter. Definitely had a hat slashing it in the current down there. Try slashing it again, see if it comes back. Only got one on. Hit the X-Wrap. Big one too. I don't know how well he's hooked. Ooh, it's a big pike. Yeah. Where's my net? Why didn't I extend it first? I'm such a dummy. Oh, look at the size of that pike. Yeah, it's a big one. This is what we're after, folks. I am such a dummy. I didn't extend the net first. Okay, yeah, that's extended. That's okay. I'm going to have to tire him out anyway. Yeah, today's the first day I've really targeted pike since the season opened. Oh, and it's a big one. Yes, yes, that's what I'm talking about. I think he might have been the one that hit earlier. All right, sinking and easy getting him in this net. He's still trying to throw the lure. He's not hooked super well. You got to be careful here. Ah, he's not huge. Not my PB. By no means, but about a 30 inch or maybe. Got him. Whoa. All right. Good thing I brought the big net. All right. Put him on the grass just until we get the hook out and then we'll bring him straight back down to the water. Yeah, buddy. That's what I'm after. Flyers. Woohoo. Maybe he is my biggest. This is a bigger pike than I thought. Might have to change out this hook afterwards. I'm not gonna I get the hook out if he'd stop slashing. Ow! Okay. Hook myself slightly. Got the pike out. Trying to swiftly get this thing out of the net. <laughs> so I can release them with the net. Maybe I'm best just carrying them to the water. Alright. Don't flop in the dirt now. So I can measure yeah, that thing's fat too. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna get a good measurement on him here. Trying to keep him in the moist grass and not on the dirt. That might be my personal best pike. I think that is. Alright, I'm just gonna just do the best I can measuring it. Here. Alrighty. Let's see. 34 and a half inches. That is my biggest pike. My biggest pike is 33 and a half inches. Now 30. Yeah, I'll call them 34 inches. 34 inches. And in fat. That is my personal best pike. Get a quick picture, and then I'll release him. And something to compare him to. Have the cooler for comparison. Had him out of the water too long already. Alright. Let's get him back in the water. If only Justin was here to take my picture with them. Try and not drop them now. Maybe I'm best doing this in the net. I'm gonna drop the thing. Alright, buddy, here we go. That is my personal best pike. And he's fat too. What's going on here? The line's stuck in his mouth. There he is. Alright. 
Well, she swam off, that's a good sign. Whoa! That's what I'm after. It's what we were after. The beaver he just saw me and turned around. I don't know what's with me and beavers lately. They've been all over the place. Alrighty, well, it's getting dark and it's starting to rain. Uh, so we're going to call it quits here. Got that one nice pike that made it worth it to come out here. Uh, did come at a little bit of a cost. I walked all around over here. I think I got, I'm pretty sure I got poison ivy. And I did end up losing three lures. I did film that whole adventure, but for the sake of time, I'm not going to include it in the video. Um, I lost an X-Rap that I caught it on. And then I lost two supposedly weedless lures. It is what it is. Got the one nice fish. I'm very happy with it. Uh, it would have been nice to catch a couple more. Probably would have caught a couple more if the bait shop had suckers. But uh, again, I'm not complaining. That's the biggest fish I've caught out of here. So I'm happy. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe. See ya.